What is up, you guys? It is Saturday. No, it's not. It is Sunday. It is Spencer. Welcome to my personal channel. Um, I figured today I'm just going to do a QA. and a I got a bunch of new subscribers, and I just wanted to um, answer some questions that I've been getting on Tumblr a lot, as well as two questions I got on Facebook. So this is just a Q&A. I hope you guys are having a great weekend, and I hope you stick around because next week I actually am going to air the collab that I did with one of my friends. So stay tuned for that. So, Tumblr on my phone, um, here we go. How do you feel about your haircut? So I love my haircut. Um, I know I said before in my older videos that my hair is a huge part of my identity. Um, I really didn't want to cut it, but now that it's been cut and I've been living with it for now two and a half weeks or two weeks, I I love it. It's it's what I want. I can't wait for the top to grow out longer and the, cur the um, coils to be uh, more pronounced but I love it and it makes me happy. <laughs> Two, your haircut's sick man. What is it on the sides? Is it a gauge? What gauge is it on the sides? Okay, so my haircut is a shadow fade. Um, so the sides and the back are faded. Um, it ranges from zero to two and then the top is just growing out and this is a hard part and it's a hard lineup so that that's my haircut three is you mentioned on your tumblr post oh my god okay you mentioned on your tumblr post about you having height dysphoria i'm sorry that you're being attacked by this but i do have a serious question as to how someone of your height can have height dysphoria especially when you are taller than the average man in america Okay, so I'm really annoyed with this question because I have literally been attacked for just explaining, stating that I felt dysphoria. I have height dysphoria around my family. My twin brother stands at 6'5", my older brother stands at 6'7". So when I am perceived as their sibling, it makes me stand out, even though I stand at six foot. I am very grateful for having the height that I have. I am very blessed to be six feet. I do understand that there are shorter guys. I do understand that there are people that struggle with height dysphoria on a daily, but just because my height dysphoria is very specific and just because I am six foot, it doesn't mean that I can't feel dysphoric about it. Um, so that's where my height dysphoria comes from. I don't tend to get dysphoria around other guys. I tend to either be average or um, a little taller, it just depends with my friend group, but I get my height dysphoria when I'm around my brothers. How old are you? I'm 23, May 12, 1992. How many tattoos and piercings do you have? I love your septum, it really looks good on you. Thank you. Um, I have seven tattoos and my septum engaged years. I had an industrial. But I took it out. I'm actually getting that re-pierced in the next month on this side though. But um, that's all I have. Alright, I think this is going to be the last question. Alright, so this is the last question. And it is... Hey, I only see you when you're in short sleeves or tank tops, but it looks like your arms are really gotten more defined. I would love for you to do comparison videos or posts on your body and transition if you feel comfortable. Um, just wondering what workouts do you do and what advice do you have for people to pre-T or just start? So I am incredibly self-conscious about my body. Um, not because of like gender dysphoria but because there's a lot of scars that I hide and I don't particularly like to show it. Um, I have gotten broader and my arms have gotten bigger. Um, in the workouts I do, I actually only do, um, underwater workouts. I don't do, I don't really lift weights ever. I don't run. I don't, um, do anything other than in the pool. So my workouts are six days a week. I do, um... A mile swimming 
So depending on how big your pool is, if it's 25 yards, which is average, or a junior Olympic size pool, then it's 33 laps. So I do a mile and then I do, depending on the day, um, certain motions and certain um, exercises underwater. I um, have water weights and I, I use water weights, I use a resistance band, I use um, a noodle, I use a pulley, and I use a kickboard. Those are the only things that I use and that's what I do. I guess I can do a water workout video sometime in the future, but I don't really have a routine. Well, I have a routine. I just don't know how to explain it. I gotta think about it. But my, my workout regimen is underwater. So I hope you guys enjoyed these answers. If you have any more questions, comments, concerns, problems, issues, qualms, please feel free to reach out to me. I am very visible. So um, yeah, until next time.